Welcome back! In this video, we are going to solve a structural design problem that involves a column design using load and resistance factor design method based on eStructural Design DAO found on the App Store. Design a reinforced concrete square column using load and resistance factor design that carries an actual dead load of 300 kips and actual live load of 200 kips. Design criteria as follows. Strength of concrete, 6,000 PSI. Vertical bars, 3-4 inch diameter, grade 60. Lateral tie bars, 3-8 inch diameter, grade 60. Steel ratio, 2%. The column carries an actual dead load of 300 kips and actual live load of 200 kips for a factored load of 680 kips. Enumerate input parameters required. Column name, C11. Floor designation, ground to second, square shape, tight column, unsupported height, 10 feet 6 inches, vertical bars, 3 4 inch diameter at grade 60, steel ratio, 2%, lateral tie bars, 3 8 inch diameter at grade 60, strength of concrete, 6000 psi, and total load, 680 kips. Given factored load equals 680 kips, the gross area of section is 210.99 square inches for a column side of 15 inches. Given steel ratio of 2% and column side equals 15 inches, the area of steel for vertical bars is 4.5 square inches. The number of bars for 3-4 inch diameter is 12. Follow the given computations for lateral ties. Design recommendation as follows. FC prime equals 6000 psi, FY equals 60000 psi, column size is 15 inches by 15 inches by 10 feet 6 inches, vertical bars of grade 60, 12 pieces 3 4 inch diameter bar, lateral ties of grade 60, 3 8 inch diameter bar, 3 sets spacing, 6 at 4 inches, 4 at 6 inches, rest at 10 inches. Thank you for watching. If you learned something from this video, please like, share, and subscribe to this channel.